welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Today for you, I'm bringing you a Disney video. This is highly requested. People keep asking me, well girl, I got your back. Here's another Disney video for you. This is gonna be how I pack my stroller for Disneyland. This is a two part video. I'm also doing what is in my diaper bag that I bring to Disneyland. So if you guys wanna see that, definitely stay tuned. And if you like this sort of thing, definitely consider subscribing and hitting that little bell so you're notified every time I post a video. I do a lot of lifestyle, mommy organization videos here on my channel and I would just love to have you guys. I'm a mom of four and I'd like to think I'm a really good packer. So I feel like this is gonna be a good video. I'm gonna list all my products, links, everything that I need to, to give to you guys in the down bar below. And question of the day is, let me know what you like to bring or pack on or in your stroller. What kind of products do you guys like to use? Let us know. Tell our friends in the down bar below. Also, if you feel like depositing some positive energies, give your girl a thumbs up. I'd so appreciate it. So without further ado, if you guys want to see how I pack up my stroller and all the things that I like to do to be prepared and have my Disney trip more magical, then just keep watching. All right, you guys, we are ready to go on an adventure to Disneyland. Here is my stroller. It is decked out, ready to go. This take me, took me a long time to figure out exactly what I wanted to have in here and how to access it because I feel like a standard diaper bag wasn't working for me. So I'm gonna go over everything that's in my stroller today. And then my next video is gonna be what is inside my diaper bag. I know these videos have been long awaited, but here is the stroller for you guys. I'm gonna start from top to bottom and go through everything that is in and on my stroller, hanging all the things that I use. And then, like I said, we'll go inside the bags and how the bags are used in the park on my next video. All right, let's get into it. So this top area here, oh, I wanna just say one thing. I love this stroller. I was not a believer. Let me give you a little, okay. So it's just one of those double side-by-side -side instead of front to back strollers. Now, the reason why I like this one, this is by Baby Trend and it is super cheap. I think this was like 150, 200 or something like that super cheap because I was looking at the Bob ones and all of that they were so expensive um, but this one fits through doors it's lightweight I mean I love it so in top in the top here this hand sanitizer is a must when you're going to an amusement park I have an extra hook if we start buying things and I want to hang the bags from the stroller I like having an extra one then I have our little first aid kit which just has band-aids and stuff and then I think I yeah stick a little Tylenol thing in here and then I have my EOS lotion so that's all that I keep up here and I can put my cell phone in here it'll still fit on the top which is really nice and then mine and my husband drinks will go at the top and then in the center here I have this thing I bought from Etsy it says my last name on the bottom family which is really cool so it kind of makes your stroller stand out which I really really like I mean obviously it already stands out but Okay, then we have, I got this from Etsy as well. This is a baby wipes cover, and I stuck a little Huggies one in here, and this is just for hands, faces, all of that. This isn't for diapering. I just like to have wipes available because you know you're eating those churros or whatever it is, and you need to wipe your face off. <laughs> and then I have tissues for snotty nose. I was gonna say snotty nose brats, but they're good. So we have tissue there and then on the side I love this I got this idea from the family fudge if you guys don't follow her seriously go follow her you are missing out she's another organized mama and I absolutely adore her she does like snacks and all that but she came up with this really great idea to get the Mickey Mouse hook and hang all of your drinks so my credit that all goes to her that's not me so I love that though okay then on this side I cannot wait to show you guys what's inside of here um, this is my diapering bag system and I'll show you guys how I use it and all that good stuff in my next video so you guys have to wait <laughs> and then I have my cooler bag I'm also gonna show you all the food and different things in that next video what is inside of here I just wanted to show you guys the basic layout of everything so I like the way that I put it here let me see if I can show you guys so see the hook is here and the handle is here I hooked it to the back, which I really like. My husband said he liked it too, because it's not 
you know, we're not kicking it. So it's further back. And I feel like too, it's gonna make sure it's more stable because it's in the middle, closer to the middle. So I really, really like this. So now I'm going to pull this down and show you guys what I have underneath here. All right, so this is my sun side. I'm gonna show you guys what I keep in here. I like to keep these here. These are just some glow sticks I got from the dollar store because I don't wanna to forget to use them. But I have this blanket. I absolutely love this blanket. Let me show you how it works here. So it opens up. I love this. I have this on a couple other videos. But what the best part about it is, it straps around the shoulder. Actually, you know what, let me just show you guys. Okay, so first you take it and you just do the little Velcro here. And then you come around on this side and do the same thing. And then they just pull it up over them and it doesn't fall on the floor. Isn't that awesome? Love this. Okay, so also in this side I have this little Mickey Mouse harness, which it's for my three-year-old. He loves to get out, and this is so good to have him have this because he would get lost no matter what. <laughs> but also with this, I have this little strap. Now this is on his side right here, and he can hold on to this. I also saw this on the family fudge. But I love how you can hold on to it, it's safe, and she had such a good idea. I punish my big kids. I make them hold it when they're not being good. <laughs> All right, next up on this side, this is my daughter's side. So she has the same type of deal. I'm probably gonna get her a little Minnie Mouse one or another Mickey one for, because this one's kind of big, but it's what we have for right now. So this is another little harness, but they love it because it's a little stuffed animal. And then she also has her little blanket. So they both have one. I can double up or we can use it on either side but love having these and they will stay there. Let's start from this side first. So this is a blanket. I love this thing. It is a Mickey Mouse blanket and it folds open to a huge size. Now I like this, we can use this for parades or whatever we want. If the kids get extra cold, it's an extra cold night, we pull this out as well. Okay. And see how it's just like everything is here. I can see everything. It's like that file folder system I was telling you guys about. Now this bag here, this is just a packing cube. I've shown you guys these packing cubes before. It's very packed, but this has the whole family's jackets inside of here. Well, they're sweaters. We have um, hoodie sweatshirts in here and I tried to fold them and squeeze them as tight as I could so they were as compact as possible. So that just goes in there and when it's time at the end of the night, because it always gets cold, in Disneyland, if you're there, it chills off at night. So always bring your jackets. Then in this bag, right next to that, this is all of our kids' extra clothing. Now, not all of my kids have extra clothes in here, just the little ones. And I think I just have a t-shirt for each of the big kids. So now I have this little thing, and this is kind of one of the unique things I wanted to show you guys. Um, one of the systems that I have in my stroller now see how everything's open I like to be able to see everything and I can just grab it. I need this bag like everything's right here and ready to go So I like this little caddy thing. You guys know I love my caddies So it's got two straps here now. It's kind of a squeeze to pull it out but My other stroller that I had the ones that are like back to back You can't really get to them easy this stroller. I love that it's high up and you can see things That's what I wanted in a stroller so grab this out it's not too bad so this is what you would see in the front of the stroller i have right here this is a little wet bag okay so if anybody has a blowout or they spill something i gotta wash it out that just stays right here okay so then in this first one this is our snacks and our bibs i like to have all the snacks and two bibs ready to go on this side and we can just pull it out and give snacks to the kids. Then in this one, this is our restaurant bag, which is completely different. Now you guys have seen my restaurant bag or if you haven't, I'll link that video down below, but I have everything that I normally bring to the restaurant in there. I do it a little different for Disney because I want it to be more compact. I don't wanna have to bring bigger bags. Like this is flat and sleek so it's super easy to carry around. I can hook it to the stroller if I need to. These are from Daiso. I'll try to see if I can find some on Amazon that have something you can hook it to. But I just have all the stuff that I have in the restaurant. I'll go over everything 
in that next video for you guys. This is just like a little peek of everything that I have. All right, then I bring this little bag. Now this might seem kind of silly, but sometimes you're sitting down, you're waiting for a parade or you're at the restaurant or whatever it is. There's been times where there's a lot of waiting. So I just bring like a couple little figurine things for the kids. This one is our medicine bag. I just, I have another first aid kit that's really big. This is just the bare minimum of things. And then this is my hair bag. So like I said, we'll get more in depth with it, but I just want to show you my stroller and my system of what everything looks like. So that is that bin here. So what's holding my cooler bag are these hooks and I really like these ones. I got these ones a long time ago, but um, these ones were actually cheaper and they came with, I think a set of three sets. Yeah, so there was six all together. So now in the front, I just wanted to show you guys I love, I've been using these for years since my first child who is 10 was born. I love these things. They keep their snacks strapped to, and for some reason it's always the snacks. I feel like they do good with the drinks they can drink and then I can put them back over here. But for the snacks, they're always falling over the place. So these work out really, really well. And I love that they just wrap around and it just works out so nice. But the last thing I have is this light, which is kind of unique and different. I don't think I've seen anyone have this, but it is a little light. So at night I can turn this on and we can see where we're going or the kids just have it lit up if I want them to watch a movie or an iPad. Super nice, I love it. Let me show you what I've hooked it on here with. I'm gonna see if I can find this hook for you guys. What I like about it is it's super gentle. It's not gonna scratch this or damage it and it's just got this hanging thing, which I really like and then I just, Kind of close. I can either go like that or I can open it up a little bit and it just kind of hangs there. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed my Disney stroller video. If you could use anything I showed you here today, give your girl a thumbs up and definitely stay tuned for that part two. I showed you here today everything inside my stroller and I will be showing you what's inside all of the bags. So I pared it down and I'm excited to show you how all of this goes together, coincides together. And if you haven't done so already, what are you waiting for, girl? Subscribe and hit that little bell. Don't forget, everything's going to be listed. And if you've made it all the way to the end of this video, thank you so much. Give me a corn dog emoji and let me know that you did. Thank you guys again so much for watching. And until next time, I'm always your girl, Anna Marie. Bye.